I'm a native uh, of uh, Uto. I uh, hereby come with uh, a little introduction into the community. Uto is a community located in Onwa East local government uh, area in Endo State. The community share boundaries with uh, Okwe to the north, Ikao to the east, Idobu in Odo State to the west, and uh, Ake and Aruko to the south. Otwa is a, a place geographically located in the equatorial region. That is at a point where the rainforest is transiting into the Guinea savannah. Hence, the occupation of the people primarily here is a agriculture. They are into farming. They farm tree crops like a cocoa, rubber, palm produce, palm trees, and so on. The root crops are yams, cocoa yam, cassava, and so on. The town is organized in an age grade structure, and the age grades are the ones responsible for the administration of the community. The age grades commence from uh, anybody that is from zero to 10. That, that age grade, we call it Akeki. That Akeki for now, they do not have a pronounced uh, masquerade they carry. From Akeki, you progress into Ogaga, you progress to Ogaga. And the Ogaga uh, age group is from uh, the ages of 10 to 15. The Ogaga age group is a, uh, an age group that has a pineapple as their symbol. And this pineapple is what we use in uh, making their uh, masquerade. From Ogara, you progress to Ogava. And this Ogava is uh, from the age of uh, 15 to 20. And uh, it is Sisa we use in preparing uh, the uh, masquerade. Then from uh, that uh, Ogava, you progress to Ogede. That is from the age of uh, about 20 to 25. Ogede age group. It's an A group that uh, their symbol is uh, the plantain leaves. They use plantain in uh, making uh, they are, they are masquerade. And their duty to the community is when there is anything that has to do with the maintenance of road or death, it is their duty to carry that out. But during festivals, it is the plantain masquerade they carry. From the plantain uh, age group, you progress into the Ikasilo. And the Ikasilo is from the age of about 20 to 25. The Ikasilo symbol is the gong. And that gong is what we call Ulo in Uto. And they, they don't have a particular masquerade they carry, but their mode of dressing is a tie of the head with the bead at the neck, without a shirt in the body, a trouser on the waist, with a cloth tied around the waist, and a hand fan. That is what they use in dancing. And this particular A grade also, they help in beating the, the uh, drum for the, the uh, master masquerade that we call Ego. Their duty also in the community is to help in the maintenance of road, uh, clearing of the marketplaces, uh, clearing of uh, waterways, and uh, they also take part in a uh, barrier. From uh, Ikasilo, you now progress to Otorigo. Otorigo is uh, another age grade whose uh, symbol is uh, the palm front. It is the palm front they use in making their masquerade. Their duty to the community is after festivals, if there is anything like clearing of the road or barrier or any other thing, they supervise the eight grades that are under them, comprising the Ikasilo and uh, the Ogede. From the uh, Igo, you now progress into Ikobi. This uh, Ikobi is uh, a point where you are trained on war tactics. That is, they are, uh, uh, a masquerade has to do with a very big basket. This basket is painted black. Then with a, a kind of girdle around their chest, then with a spears. Then the second is uh, of uh, the Igobi is the one that uh, is consulted with the helmet. 
Then uh, the person carrying that particular uh, masculine moves around with a uh, bow and arrow. Then after that, we now progress into the Utoyima, which is uh, the masquerade proper. This masquerade A group is where you are to carry the masquerade. And this masquerade here is so beautifully and artistically designed that anyone that sees it, just as you have them in the video clips, you will appreciate the, the work and uh, the ability of uh, our old men to make design with uh, the uh, uh, materials from the forest. now you, pro you progress to Egwibia and Egwibia is uh, from the 35 to 40 years of age. This Egwibia they don't have a, a particular masquerade they carry. Theirs is to help in piloting the masquerade when they are moving from one quarter to the other. Theirs is to dress and uh, you know accompany the uh, people carrying the masquerade 
and in places where so any uh, heavy masculinity is having uh, difficulties, they come to their uh, rescue. From there, you progress into the Otu Lisa. The, from every year Otu Lisa, within this particular period, you spend about uh, 10 years. So, what they do is, the Otu Lisa is an A group that is uh, 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 made up of three A groups joined together. Their duty also is to help to supervise the masquerade and uh, the the activities that are taking place in the town, having to do with clearing of uh, bushy places and so on. Then from Otunesa, you progress to Ikeo. The Ikeo are the guardians of uh, the community. They are a symbol of uh, authority. is a uh, uh, spear, a bag, and uh, a hand fan. Any issue having to do with uh, uh, the community, uh, having to do with the uh, section of quarrel and so on, it is their duty. Wow. Then from here you now progress to Imwewe. Imwewe in Utah is uh, an age group which from where you transit to become an Otobubu. In uh, Imwewe, they move around with uh, walking sticks. And their duty in the community is to liaise with the Igeo and Oturisa for the smooth administration of the community. Then from uh, Imwewe, you progress to Otobubu. This Otobubu is the, large, uh, is the last uh, hurdle as far as the first pass is uh, concerned. At this particular age, from 70 to 80, you perform this festival, and once you, you perform it, you become Otobubo and you can be branded there, uh, Ikeroki. From Ikeroki, you now graduate into Isago. That Isago is, you are from uh, 80 and uh, above. Then the times of these festivals, Upeso said that is the masquerade festival, usually take place between December and February every year. Then Upesigo, which has to do with uh, the ones that follow the masquerade, is a uh, always coming up between the months of February and March every year. September to October we have a New Year festival. Then uh, November we have a Then uh, the Ubogwe festival is every 10 years. But every December, February is uh, the, the particular period we have a Ubogwe festival. And that Ubogwe festival is so colorful because we have different masquerades to display at this particular time. My name is Atibo Ransom Isiboku. Thank you very much.